covering the world, covering the nation, breaking news 24 hours a day. And now from our studios in New York, Dylan McBride. And hello, America. Here are the top stories we have going on at the hour. Reports are in this hour that two lower level members of the radical Islamic group, Radi Allahu, were killed in the U.S. zone strike on the Pakistani border. Officials say that the suspects were responsible for a number of tasks and duties, from camel parking to rug swatting. Officials are keeping the rest of the findings classified for national security reasons. Officials did go on to say, however, that we are winning the war on terror and we are continuing our efforts to bring freedom to the people of the Middle East. 45 civilians were also killed in the zone strike. On a more somber note in today's news, actor Barney McFadden who played Poopy the Dinosaur, was found dead in an NYC hotel room. Poopy the Dinosaur was a beloved character to millions of kids, and parents are encouraged to talk to their children about their feelings. A spokesperson from Zyrtec Pharmaceuticals made a statement earlier today, stating that Poopy the Dinosaur was a beloved character to millions of kids and will be missed. Zyrtec Pharmaceuticals will also be introducing a new drug on the market, helping young people deal with anxiety and depression. All right, what the fuck is this shit? Is this shit for real? Look, kid, Zyrtec is a major sponsor on this network. Hell, they're marketing six different drugs on this show alone. And that cocksucker McFadden owed bookies in Vegas over 20 grand for the past three months. It wasn't paying up. Something had to be done. Wait, that was a hit? Yeah, <laughs> Zyrtec needed some national tragedy to fuck these kids up. You know, to launch their new drug. <laughs> Those fucking ad guys. <laughs> Don't you know that was a little thing? You know, kind of like a strange coincidence? Uh, hell of I know. I hated that fucking clown. Uh, no, what, what I'm saying is, doesn't it look like Zyrtec had a hand in all this? Jesus, kid. Who the hell is paying attention? The public ain't as bright as you think they are. Okay, kid, I got a call coming in. Go ahead, take five. So you're telling me with that tiny camera and laptop, you're going to make this look like a big news studio? Look, kid, this is the CIA. We invented Santa Claus, the Easter Bunny, and weapons of mass destruction. Hey, are you on Zoloft or Xanax? Uh, Xanax. Okay, this shit here is what we call low-budget Valium for the masses. We could do this broadcast on a smartphone if we needed to. Look, kid. God damn it, why does everyone keep calling me kid? I'm a five-year field operative. Is this your first day at Outpost 33? Yes. Then you're just about over your head. This is where all the spooks and their paths meet. This is Monarch. Hey, Monarch? Wasn't that shut down back in the 1960s? Bet you heard that on TV. Well, yeah, I think so. Okay, trust me, kid. You're over your head. And you're a douchebag to boot. <laughs> douchebag? Well, let's just say you're a little wet behind the ears. I need a break. <laughs> 